It's your my guys. Welcome to WW Phoenix. Christ show E W W Phoenix. Uh, this is Morning with Martin. Uh, we got a full crew today. Dean's not in yet at the moment, but he probably pop in. You're the door going up. But we got Josh and Amy in the house anyway. Okay, and we are live with the River Scene build. And you can see I've got a mess on my desk. Yeah, is a mess on the desk. Um, how are we all? Yeah, let's have a look at it. We got current five view viewers. Thanks for my morning, Rob. Uh, from the crew, no, from no Sunny audio. Suffolk. No yeah. audio. Have a check down on the. No audio. Can you check down? No audio. No audio. Audio's playing. It's there. Uh, can everybody else hear me? Sound. Ray, we got no sound with you. Nobody else got. We got sound. We got sound working. Sound is working for us. Is it? Yeah, it's working on us. Yeah. There. I can see it going up and down. Yeah. Come on, if you look at it. Oh, no, he said, my bad. <laughs> He's probably oh. on mute. <laughs> <laughs> Ray! Oh, come on, Ray, you frightened me there, look. Just, oh my god, here we go! Flap, flap, flap. You've got to turn your volume up. Ray. Yeah, Ray, there's a volume button. Yeah, there's a volume button on somewhere the guy who's supposed to turn it up. So. Oh, classic, classic. So there we go, we've already set the scene, ready to go, yeah, to set the mood. We <laughs> we can have a good one today. You can see, <laughs> sound is good from Kelly. Thanks, Kelly. Um, we got Dean is making a coffee today because it was a lovely cup of coffee from uh, from Amy. However, it was full of sugar and it was really really strong, and I couldn't <laughs> sleep last night. Other than that, on the third Wednesday night. So, <laughs> Dino is going to make it for us. Uh, right. Um, uh, let's let's, let's uh, wait on. Yeah, we can hear Brian. Good evening, sir. Thank you very much for coming. Aussie mob are ready to watch and learn a good evening there, yeah, lovely. Um, so good morning, or good evening, sorry, to everybody down down under. Yeah, you know what I mean? Um, I've, guys, you're going to love this one, obviously, because it's relevant to what, you know what I mean, to the colours of you. So, <laughs> Ray, yeah, yeah, <laughs> well done, Ray. How many beers you've had already? Yeah, you're on the wine already, that's my job, that is. So. <laughs> As you noticed, I've had my haircut. Yeah, I've had the haircut from what I call it, at last. I look... Ten times younger people were saying to me, uh, you know what I mean, and my, my, my I'm, I'm dashingly good looking anyway, so. <laughs> uh, I'm going to have some fun today, All right? Uh, yes, last week was just sort of airbrushing and uh, and, and whatnot. I could have some different cam camera angles to show. Yeah, you can see there where I sort of finished off, uh, finished off a few things. Uh, it's come, come to life a bit, a bit more now, yeah, you know what I mean? Um, you can see that I've started doing the riverbed here. Um, although I'm having doubts on the riverbeds of other people who will not be men mentioned, Amy and Dean. So, <laughs> you know what I mean? So some feedback, guys, of what, what we think of that, right? Uh, the river's going to come up. I've got... Uh, excuse me while I stretch over and get my bits and pieces. So there's um, clear perspex, which is going to go in the front there and the front there. Yeah. That type of thing, which we're going to dam off. I'm hoping to get that done today, uh, and then so we can next week. I, I might. What I'll do is with Amy is I'll pour the resin. Not live. Okay. So it's ready for next Wednesday. Yeah. So I can finish up. So we'll finish it off next Wednesday. But pretty much once the resin's done, there's only a bit of like sanding back uh, and stuff like that. Which you know what I mean. Which I'll do. I either finish it off camera next week or I, I'm not going to get it done by this week I'm going to have to might have to block this up first because I've never done I've done it with tape but I've never done it with with this and I don't know and I've only got like three mil but there so it's going to be a bit of guesswork <laughs> and I just don't want it it's going to be a lot of resin going in there and I don't want to pour it and then it just sort of ends up on my lap Right, so anyway, so that's what I've got. I got another piece here somewhere. Yeah, there we are. So there's three three bits of thing that I'm going to do around there. So we're going to get a good, trying to going to get a good depth because I might have to pour it twice as well. So again, you know, I mean, I know you guys, I mean, sitting there with a cup like that, you know, what I mean, might not want to call it. Well, we got 17 people in already. That's fantastic. Yeah, watching from Granger in the US. Oh, excellent. Welcome. Welcome, Dan. Thanks very much. Uh, first one coming to a, a Martin. I hope so. I hope you love it. 
My glue and activator came yesterday, so today I'll maybe glue myself to the shed. Cow, <laughs> don't you? Yes, arm's length like that and use it. <laughs> right, for God's sake. <laughs> Timber Surf, no, hello from North Wales. I mean, um, uh, are you mate? Are you Timber? I didn't know you're up in North Wales. Ah, well, well, are you a fellow Welshman? Uh, you know what I mean? I, I'm not sure on that one. Um, hi there from. Uh, uh, for all the good day to all those down under, yeah, we got so we we're, we're all across the, you know, what I mean, we're over down there, up there, around there, we're, uh, Granger in America. I'm not, sorry, I do apologise. My my geography was not my not my strongest point there again. Nothing was my strongest point in school. So, <laughs> uh, right, okay, so um, yeah, I got a got a camera three for us, Amy, please. That that's what I sort of done so far on the on the thing. I have got a little area here to carry on. To carry on with I've got a the, the riverbed um, I think it is too bright I don't know you know I mean I have done a little bit of weathering to try and tone it down a bit and I've added a little bit of tones in there um, this might be in the wrong color maybe I need to just gray it off dark gray it or something like that and try try something now I've got a bit of oh I've left that I have a question about water I 3d printed some fish I was wondering how to go about Setting up, ah, ha, ha, Kelly. So you're watching. You were watching. Watching today. So go to two, to two, to two. So that's a. Where, where are we go. Where, where, look, look, look at that little beauty. Okay. So that's enough about them. But also, I got. And I got Dean to print some more because I did make a little bit of a mess of them. But I got that. Uh, let me get into shot. Your hand going, you? Yeah. So, look, there's some fish, <laughs> right? So, go, go to camera one again. Cal, two part epoxy glue, epoxy glue. You know them ones you got in the tubes like that that you push out, right? Push a blob onto. Uh, you've got you bought. Oh, I dropped it now. You bought the box, yeah, off us, and you had some silicone paper in it, right, like that, right? Okay. So this is not my technique, right? There's, you know, I mean, there's a big YouTuber out there that I copy the symbols like that, right? And and it works, it works too. And, and this is, post a video as and well. it, yeah, yeah, we post a video or something like that to show you as well, right? Um, we you filmed it, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah, well, actually, we filmed it doing it yesterday, so we'll post a video later on so you can see it anyway, right? But uh, for a certain piece of paper, if you go to camera three, I can do it on camera three. Yeah. Then you get your your your, your epoxy resin, put a blob onto there, and then get a bit of a stick. Um, a stirring stick, right? Something like that. And flatten off the edge, right? You know, I mean, cut the edge off or something like that. You want it nice and or on a slope. If I can cut it, like like that, right? Something like that. I'm doing and rushing it now for you, stuff like that, right? Then dip it in the blob in the blob of glue, and then you just want to stem, right? If you notice, I got the, these went wrong. That's why I got Dean to do some more, right? But if you notice, I've got. Uh, I got them on a stem like that, right? Okay, and then all you do is you add them onto the top of, of the of the stem. Yeah, if you notice that one, they've got that one as going up upwards. That's because it's going to have a jumping out. And then what you do is you cut once it's gone off, right? It's solid. That is like uh, you can it goes brittle. It's cut it to the length that you think that you want it, and then uh, glue it upright. Like that, so you've got it. It's upright and it stays upright. Yeah, get selling them fish. I'll buy. I'll buy them. Yeah, yeah. Kelly ordered. <laughs> yeah, and then and then it just it's just the how far. I mean, I'm having I'm having fish that are coming out of the water. So you just have different lengths of the stems like that. Yeah. Put it on the paper. Okay. Hang on. So we get um. I've these are black, these fish are black. Yeah, can you see them like that, Cal? Let me know if you can see them like that. That's this like the, the, these these went I tested them yesterday and I knew what I did wrong. I did I need to buy, like you, Cal, I need to buy the stuff that we got, I got it in a big gun for uh, for doing our applicators. <clears throat> which was it was too runny, but the other stuff is quite nice and thick, so you can just put it through the watercolour. I'm just gonna quickly go through uh, I will be here until 10. Well, thanks, Thomas. Thanks for coming. 
Hello, Martin and crew. Hello in the chat. Uh, I have had I have. I might prefer more of them. <coughs> you need to get the red kite perch somewhere. Ah, red kite. You say, yeah. I used to have a pair of red kites, not red kites, a fish eagle. Bald eagle! That's what I'm doing, which is a fish eagle. <coughs> um, I just need to get them selling more and all. Uh, I can see, mate. There are, yeah, and all you do then is you cut that stem to, you know, I mean, how deep you want your fish. And you can have them at different levels. And the stem should then blend into the into the water so you won't see it. You shouldn't see it. Yeah, so, uh, you know, I mean, make sure you get clear. That's a good thing. If you order it, make sure it's clear. So that, that type of thing as well, right? Um, I put him somewhere. Yeah, and that is a eagle, soaring eagle. Oh, you can't see it. I might go over there. It's a get my so and that's a soaring eagle, which I was going to have perched on a tree, but then Mark turned around and said, "You can't have him perched on a tree because he's in flight." And I would say, "Well, he's just about to leap off the branch into the fish," but then I'm thinking of having him in on the water I'll get my fat thumb out of the way pulling a fish out yeah so he's jumping into the water where's that black mark so I can see it there, there yeah so he's, he's in the water like that pulling and the fish is half out of the water hence the stem yeah see if we can do the stem um, so pour in the water we might have to do on camera mm. I'm talking sorry I'm talking to Amy okay but that's that's next week uh, like you so teased you now We've also I've got a massive announcement next week. Do we try to tease them? Should we tease them? For sure, not teasing him. Look, he looks easy. Yeah, he does, mate, to be fair. Dean Dean uh, got that from somewhere. Yeah, and the fish. The fish are perch. Right, which is going to, people are going to say, we don't get perch in rivers like that. So, you know what I mean? But that's the only thing that Dean could print out quickly for me. So, <laughs> so unfortunately, I, you know I mean? I got perch. I am going to colour paint them perch. I was looking at it, well, so I'm going to paint them um, what's it called? Uh, uh, painting with the black stripes. They got black perch. got black stripes in them. So I was going to put that into it. Um, and it's a you know, I mean, this is a Welsh Valley somewhere, right? I know, so I'm the expert on it. And <laughs> no, I'm not. Right? Anyway, it's just a bit of fun and stuff. Uh, so uh, yeah, Levensies. Well, I'll sort of tell you something that might be coming available soon. Ish. <laughs> so or might not. I don't know. It all depends if I get. If, if the boss Amy lets me love, allows to say something. Right, okay, so uh, there we are. That was a nice little bit of, um, that sounds amazing. Yeah, that, that, that was a nice one. Thanks, Kel. I love questions. If I can sort, sort them out. And wow, you know what I mean? You must have been mind reading it. You know what I mean? I was literally doing it. We did it yesterday, didn't we? Mm. Yeah, we, we did that fit, uh, that film in yesterday. So well done, yeah? You know what I mean? Co contact us any time as well. Like, if I can help, I, I will. If not, I'll go and find out something and come back and teach you as if I'm the expert, so. <laughs> that type of thing right so um the riverbed uh yeah i'm i'm sort of working on it right um I, it is nice it's got a nice bit of green and stuff like that i i'm not gonna i don't want to color the water i don't want to if as soon as you put a murky you're not going to see the detail in it at all right so um, i don't i'm obviously because i'm putting fish into it and i'm going to use our uh, our water textures as well which is you know i mean um uh, which will, you know, if the eagle's going in, you're going to have splash marks around it. So I'm going to try and do that again. Something that I've never done, but you know, I mean, let, let, let's have a go. Like, you know, what I mean, like I said, I can afford to make mistakes on this because you know, I mean, the, the guys are very good at editing photos. <laughs> so Josh has been rather quiet. Why are you being Josh quiet, Josh? I work, oh, you go work, please go work. Yeah, so, well, fancy that. Huh? You've know, got to come to work to do work. <laughs> um, so uh, yeah, so. Maybe that we'll have to do the pour, um, and the stuff that I got is twenty four hours. See, that's the problem. Mm. Forty eight. Unless we start it Tuesday, film it, and, and then, then finish it. Finish it during the during yeah. the live. We'll see. We'll, we'll see. We'll have to do a test spot. I'll do a test spot. Sorry, guys. And talk about yourselves. I'm talking to uh, Amy on what uh, what to do. Anyway, we'll um. So adding foliage now. Adding the up here and you know I mean that type of thing. Um. I've got no inspiration for it at all. Uh, I'm just going to sort of wing it, right? You know me, but you know me. Um, I got uh, bits and pieces that I can use. Yeah, this type of thing. Um, you know me for a for a bush or something like that. But it, this this tends to go out of scale quite quickly. Um, and then I got my old faithful, which is the C4. 
Yeah. Well, which is, I'm still looking at that root system that I got from the last thing, and I mean that that, that root system there, you know, I'll come across. It's stunning. You know what I mean? So maybe I can do something. I don't know. Work mm. on it. Something with that. But it's going to be a bit of delicacy. Now that I'm not having a fish eagle jumping off a branch, and maybe a tree branch coming up there is not the right thing to do. Uh, but all we're going to do is sort of add a bush detail coming, you know what I mean, coming down because I, I saw some pictures that was close to here. Um, actually, so we got these as well. Yeah, the clump foliage, which I've got, which for there. Yeah, that type of thing, which I saw there was quite a lot of it there. But again, I'm going to put this on really sparse, really work on uh, And I want to be careful of the water level as well, you know what I mean? Because the fish is going to, it's going to be quite deep. So maybe it might have to come up to here for me to get the fish in different levels. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Oh, good morning, everyone. Is Martin behaving? Don't forget to like. Yeah, Martin's on his best behaving today so far. So, uh, <laughs> so yeah. So you know, what I mean, so for me to get any height, different height, the water level. I'm looking at the water level. It's gonna have to be roughly around about an inch. If that's an inch. That's gonna come up to there. That's too deep. Um, so. All I'm looking at now, I'm going to get one of the fish. For this to be swimming. I can't see that that well. Okay, I'm, I'm just testing. Sorry guys, I'm testing. I need to see if I can wedge that fish. If I got that, well, that fish is too big. I'm going to have to come up to you there. Mm. So we'll have to use. So, Dean, Dean, are you on you? If you are, come in here. The smaller ones. Yeah, the smaller ones. So, so there is. Um, uh, so I think they are 15 mil, and the other ones that I got is 10 mil. So, yeah. So they are too big. I think they are too big. The other one, the smaller ones, are 10 mil. I think they are the, probably the best ones. Which now I can, if I put this into scale. So again, like this, we, we were testing scales and stuff like that, what we need to do. If I put that Use the hand. into, I'm just trying to wedge it into a stone or something like that. Mm. That looks a lot better. Yeah. You can just sort of see it there. Oh, oh, Dean, I'm talking to you. You are listening there. You are on anyway. So, there, so I'm talking to Dean because he's going to be printing some more for me anyway. Like, um, the 10 mils are the perfect size. The, the, to, the, these are too big. Because if I put that, mil. if I put yeah the fifteen mil, if I put that into there, you can clearly see. If I do it that way, guys, yeah, I know we're swimming the wrong way. Can get him standing up. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, he's huge. It's massive. He's bigger than some of the boulders that that, that, that are in there. You know what I mean? And then if I put that one there, there, oh, that, that's perfect. Yeah, I think the 10 mil that well, we decided, plus then I haven't got to pour so much resin. Yeah, I can have them, um, you know I mean, smaller. That works up the tree. No, okay, so there's the decision made. And then if I can come into here, and Amy will show what I call it. If I can pick him back up. <laughs> so modeling is also, I mean, most people will do, I mean, we're doing this on the fly as well. So if I do that, that's roughly, where's he gone? I lost a fish. I might do that. That's about right. Yeah, there's a big fish for him, yeah, but I think anything smaller. <laughs> it's not focusing. <laughs> Well, then I think you, they can see it. You can see that, can you? Yeah. My, my, my hands. There, we, there go. we go. Yeah. 
I think that's a good one. That coming out of the water, being pulled out of the water, that'd be great. Yeah, so 10 mil. Even if you can go down to 8 mil on some of them, so a different size, will it make a difference? I don't know. Have a look. Have a look at some of them. Try so and make it quite a bit so I can have a good pack going through on there as well, right? The man's ink is bigger than his woman ink. <laughs> yeah. Uh. Right, okay, so that roughly that is, you know, I mean, that's what we're going to be doing, right? That's the sort of the size and stuff again. I'm glad now I did that because I was going to spend the ages painting up them big fish and they're too big. Yeah, and it gives me, you know, I mean, I can now, if that's the biggest, biggest stem, so Cal, I'll show you that stem. If I can, yeah, look at the size of that stem, right? You know, I mean, you can see the size of that. If I put a uh, so there, there's a standard, there's a pencil, yeah, I'll put that pencil next to it, there's a size of it, yeah. If it's come on, you know, problems this camera, I mean, it's a nightmare. Oh, that. There's Amy's hand, look, hey, <laughs> famous Amy hand, okay. So there's a the size of the stem, and I know now that that will fit lovely. And if that's the biggest one I can do, and then I get my stick from my lap, put my glasses on it. Glasses at you? No, they're not. They're down there. Sorry, guys, bear with me. But you know, I mean, this preparation prevents poor performance. <laughs> yeah, no, I can go at least high, that high. So that's how high the the the, the water is going to be. Half inch maybe. Mm. And I got plenty of room to to add height to it and stuff like that. So I'm going to keep that little fella. Yeah, safe over there because I know that he's going to be that's my guy. There, what? Well, job sorted. So now um oh, what I need what I want to do was I'm going to put a depth indicator for myself by here. So I'm going to go to I'm going to say about there. Okay. Now there is a reason why I'm doing this, right? Other people might do it differently and stuff like that. I'm literally doing this as a wing. Um, I put a little mark on that. And that's where, where my depth thing. And now I know how far down my foliage is going to start. Yeah, so I do that. I'm going to say, right, my foliage is going to start. Oh, you can't see it. <laughs> my foliage is going to start from up there because it's nowhere near the water. Yeah, okay, that type of thing. That's what I'm thinking of, right? And you know, what I mean, bits of foliage. Then I can start looking. Where's it going to come to here? Yeah, I know that I can go up there because the water is not coming anywhere near it. Okay, so I can have something sponged onto that, and then we can start building little bits of bushes and stuff like that coming up there then. So, and I'm not too fussed, so I'll just show you quickly, you know what I mean? That type of thing. Or we can have it overhanging. If it stays. That type of thing. Okay. Ah. And then we can dress over there. And I'm not too worried if foliage falls into there because, um, you know, I mean, you'll have that foliage going into that base anyway, yeah, that type of thing, right? Um, I'm going to build up a little bit more by here, right? Because obviously uh, you'd have the bank sort of going up into it, yeah? So I'm going to just put a bit more, a um, bit more rocks I've got. So I find red. So this is this is our where are we? That one no, that one there. Oh, that's a cracking shot. So there we are. Yeah, medium red, red grid uh, stone, right? Ballast. I'm just gonna build up a little bit more here, right? Which will blend in lovely because when it's just wet, it goes a darker red. And obviously in the let me pull that out of the way. In the um in the resin it will always look wet. So and it can be loose now. I've so I've glued the main base down, this base down, yeah, with our uh, sand and gravel fixer, okay, yeah, liquid liquid glue, 
same as the Gower Ballas, pour it straight onto the onto the sand and gravel. Yeah. Um, which one of you two designed this label? Uh, joint effort, brother. Joint effort by the pair of them by there. Oh, is it Josh going to see me now, not man? Oh, there's Amy. Amy you know. uh, I see. Look, look, look. She's being modest then. Like. Yeah, yeah. Josh is, you know what I mean, being the gentleman. Amy was being the gentleman. <laughs> <laughs> okay, just, just building it building it up. That's all. So I now can go into this side here now as well. Because this is the side I was going to wait for you guys anyway. So uh, stem the glue. Then paint them up I try and paint the fish first. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm just catching up. What I call it. Um, um, yeah, so to paint the fish first and then uh, stem them up. Because that was the mistake I did on them, I was on the other ones as well. So. I'm doing it pinch by pinch because I want to control how much I put in there, but you can also move it around. I'll show you now. Let's get some of that stuff in the way. I just want to sort of bank that up first. Actually, with them, that redness by there is starting to break that up anyway. Yeah, I like that. It looks a lot better, doesn't it? I had, uh, like I said at the beginning, I had. Uh, jo um, Dean and Amy shouting at me. Doesn't look like. So we just put a little bit in there loose. I got bigger stones here that we can use as well. So uh, just to. What are we got one here? No, that one here. Uh, yeah, it's just a bigger stone. But you don't want to have too, too much of these because. Sometimes he can bounce out the scale. But like I said, I'm having it clear. I, I mean, I, it, most people murky the water, but I want, um, I'm, you know I mean, I, I'm using our water effects, sorry, our, our water textures. So I want to have that, I, I'm gonna practice on this. Um, that's why I'm keeping it clear, because I want to add the, you know I mean, the, 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 hopefully the ripples as the eagle goes in, has taken the fish out. You'll obviously have water spatting out, so I'm gonna have a try and do that effect as well. So, you know, I mean, it should be. That's why I'm doing it clear. It might not be right, but it is for me. And uh, some, we know there's some people that'll watch it. So now um, I got some uh, our army coarse sand. Yeah. Okay. Uh, that's it's a lovely. It's got the pebbles in it. Yeah. It's a good grit. It's a good base for it. Um, so I'm just going to add that now to it as well. So just sort of all about pipe pile it in, and then what I do, get a nice brush. Get them going out the way. A nice size brush, yeah, that's an inch and a half. Yeah, and then just sort of start pushing it down. And for those of you that know him, David Bailey's by the side of me. I don't know a <laughs> female. Uh, David, have you got a famous female photographer? Yeah, Laws. Is it, is it? So I, I need to find out there. Ooh, tell me. Um. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I just put it on the spot and you don't know. So you can see the difference from that colour to that colour. So you can see the amount of work that I've done on it. Yeah, you know what I mean? But I also like to add then, um, we got uh, our army fine sand, right? Because it's too bulky, if you know what I mean? Too. No, oh, goodbye, Josh. <laughs> Josh has left the building. Okay, and you know, I mean, the, the beauty about doing a big brush big, with a big brush as well, you get that sort of waviness as well. But then I like to fill in, fill in as well, right? So it looks a little bit 
thicker and if I any like redness there that I see with the baseboard I can see I, we fill it in with this type of thing with color and it's a different color as well but also, I've also got uh, our desert sand as well which is which I'll show you now in a minute okay and then we got uh, our desert sand yeah which is that color okay so um, can you oh, God. I've not seen. I've not seen you. Uh, yeah, I got. That's that's something me and Dave were talking about yesterday. We're gonna put it fix the. Um, sorry, let me take my what I call it. morning mark. Nice to come in, mate. <laughs> you start off with that lava. Don't you start with that lava? <laughs> yeah, you stinker. Uh, I, yeah, with a fixer, I, with a with the foliage, I'll super glue it on because it's quick, nice and quick and easy and simple for me in that one. Uh, but I am going to use a hot glue gun uh, on the perspex. You know, I mean that 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 works perfect to to dam it up. Like, and I mean, it's just I haven't used uh, what I call monogis. I haven't used it so uh, on different um, uh, on the perspex yet. So I have used it on a different diorama that I did. So, so another different color now going in. Yeah, it just sort of breaks it up. Um, and then I'll put in you know, them I'll finish off it here yeah, and we put some fixing into it. Yeah. Um, and it will sort of change colour. It won't be this bright, bright colour. Right. Uh, but I need to do some more over here. Get some bigger stones going around. And then, um, if I get the fixer down first, that will start drying up lovely. Um, and then uh, I can carry on with the foliage bit then as well. I've lost my bag of plants. So again, big chunk of it down. Yeah, and then, um, yeah, just spread it out. Uh, it's an open, open-ended model. Um, so obviously, all this you just this is going to be the. You know, I mean, this bit you can see of the model. It's all going to be open, just water. So obviously, I've got to sand down the 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 the, uh, the resin when it's done, when it's gone off the water, when it's gone off. Uh, but it'll be exposed so hopefully you can see through the water then um for the water for the fish and stuff like that and that, that's that's the purpose of it so. okay i just made a wee wee drama of a mistake by doing that way don't do it that way do it that way because that's the way the the, the flow of the water is going to be yeah that's what i wanted to flow like this so so it causes natural ridge, ridges and just adds to it because the resin will pick up as you know will pick up all uh, all the different things under it uh, right okay so the little, little bit more texture going again now so uh, army fine pin, pinch of army fine yeah uh, just to start filling in make it look a lot solid Put it down, and it goes all over me. And then, a bit over there. And then a bit of desert sand there, but I did a different color texture. And, and this looks pretty wicked as well, on, on, the, on top of there. Yeah, it just adds to that like sort of debris to it and stuff like that, so loose debris. Uh, different colour stones now, so this is our fine uh, light grey. Yeah, so that's not light grey, dark grey. Light fine grey stone. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Uh, just again, you know, I mean, sprinkle around just to have a different because you know, I mean, in the river, just because it's red there doesn't matter because it could be, you know, I mean, that river might be 20 miles long and it could drag grey stone from up there, like, I mean, all down there or whatever, up there and up there, stuff like that. So, you know, we'd always have different types of stones and stuff like that in the bottom of the river, unless I'm wrong. Uh, there's some, oh, get off that. Oh, it's still on. Yeah. I'll move this. Yeah, yeah, you can control mm. it. Uh, so I've got some big stones again. Uh, again, round the... Big boulders round there. Uh, i got... So these are rocks and pebbles. This camera. Oh, um, I've changed. <laughs> uh, rocks and pebbles, yeah. Nice pebbly stones, rounded stones. They are big. So I'm going to just select a few. Some, maybe some flat ones would be nice. Yeah, and then we just randomly place. That one. You want that big one? Hmm. It's too big. Oh. Look. Yeah, it'd be nice on the edge. Okay. <laughs> that's, a, that's Amy's pebble. <laughs> yeah. Uh, some nice big ones. If you get some nice big ones in there, then you can have it where, where the waters flow in that way. It will it will cause that to go around, and then we can have an effect in there. selection is important Gonna be at the bottom, you know, you can't see it. I'll do over here. This will be at the bottom of the of the river. What did you see? Yeah, leaves like that, wouldn't you? Maybe a bit lighter. Just take that away then. That's better, isn't it? Yeah. So this is our clump foliage, yeah. In in the words of Amy, coming soon. <laughs> <laughs> we don't want too much. I like actually that's that's just broken that up now as well, isn't it? Yeah. Nicely. We were we were just wondering if some something it needed something. Um someone's asking, are you adding a base to the diorama or a frame to the base? <sighs> Uh, yes, so architrave, you know the door frame architrave, so underneath, and uh, Mark, yeah, oh, right, underneath, if, yeah, I should have done it first, uh, but I, I got excited and, <laughs> and got on with it, uh, yeah. well, Tim, right, so I, yes, we should, and we've got, actually, let me pass you the diorama board, with there, so uh, we've got these coming up shortly, right, Dean's working on them now, um, they're going to be quite quick, actually, as well, coming out. But this is the type of thing that um, we're going. I need the camera on me now somewhere. Right, so Amy's going to change the camera angle quickly and uh, walk amongst yourselves while we do it. But yeah, we are. We're going to. You know, I mean, we are diorama boards, and from now on, I'm going to have to start using these. Right, you know what I mean. But um, there we go. Ta-da! <laughs> Planet technology. Yeah. 
So frame for that, right? Uh, you've got an easy, so you've got a little edge around there as well, so it's nice and easy to pick up. Yeah, but there's there's all sorts of ones. There's that side, there's that side, there's one on its own that way, there's bigger ones, smaller ones. Yeah, and obviously uh baseboards coming out as well. So which me and Dean are gonna build on camera as well, you know what I mean? So that'd be a good one. Um, and we might even do a small, tiny little ring. No, we're not. Shut up. <laughs> yeah, so that's what I'm going to be using for now on. Uh, I just had this bit of board lying around. I thought, oh, I don't know what, I'll use that. So, because it'll look cool. Right, okay. Um, oh, I'll tell you what I'm going to add now a little bit more. Is this, is our Spanish foliage yet? Same, same colours as the, what I call it. But it just adds to the detail. right on the edges because that's where the nicer grow and I'm gonna add detail and this is not gonna be a fast flowing river either you know what I mean it's gonna be like us chilled there we go I actually quite like that so now what I'm gonna do now fix it okay uh, where we are come this one are we yeah. yeah, yeah. There's our fixer, right? Okay, I've used some of it. I might. It comes in hundred mil. Take the lid off, and then just simply pop it down. Yeah, and it it rocks into the rocks. It, it rolls into the rocks straight away. Yeah, I gotta come over here because I did. Oh, come on. That rock there looks stunning. Mm. It looks like it's part of that. So I'll just quickly glue it down. Yeah, any foliage, put a little bit around it, just to glue it down, and then this lot. Fix it down. Uh, it will change the colour, yeah, because it's, you know I mean, it, it'll go darker, right? But the resin will do that anyway, right? So, and I want it darker anyway, because... Oh, actually, I'll leave that there. Yeah. Okay. And this will help seal the um make sure you move it away from the work on it. Seal the base as well for the resin. It's going to be really heavy. That's why I'm going to um, go. So going back to Brian's point, I am going to put a base into it because uh, it will, it'll flex like that and probably split my plaster. Yeah. So always buy WWS diorama boards because <laughs> <laughs> oh, we'll always use WWS diorama boards because they are brilliant. Um, you know I me. Mean? Don't don't do what I do and get shouted at because you don't follow. And in my fairness, though, this was done before the boards were done. Dean literally designed them and printed them off about a, two days ago. Well, Dean, you're on here. When did you do it? But it is, yeah, you're right. It is going to be mega heavy. And, you know what I mean? Yeah, you can see the glue just soaking straight in. Some bits we might miss and come off, but don't worry about it, you know what I mean? If this small little detail comes off, doesn't matter, does it? I'm going to make sure that that's glued in, because I've got a little bit of sea foam just for there, which is 
turn the label to face me. Mm. Yeah, that is sand, complete sand by there. And that's why it's staying up on the surface at the moment, but you will see it starting to seep through. I said glue the foliage bits in. So I did this side yesterday um, and within a couple of hours it's starting to dry up. Yeah it's quite quick, it's quite fast. Okay, so but for 24 hours it'll be totally, totally, totally done. So I'm just going to sweep away now the bits right here because I don't want it gluing down. Um, I am, guys, I do I work, I am modeling, so I, I will come back and forth the questions. If I missed your question, please, please, please put it back again. Yeah, you know what I mean? I'll, I'll uh, try my best to, to answer them. Okay, just sweep that out of the way because I don't want the model to, to, to glue to the paper and go <laughs> rip it up. Um, so yeah, I think that's it. There's your riverbed, done. Okay, right. Um, that color might be different to that color, so I've got to blend it in a bit, because I've done a little bit of weathering to that one. Um, so we might add to it. But what we're gonna do now is concentrate now on the top of, uh, on the top, a uh, bit more, a bit more forward, because I do, do want to have a heavy foliage. Right, so we are gonna go big style. So let me just have a look at uh, any questions. Uh, hit the yeah. Thanks, Jace. Uh, just to go because the weight of the water and the stones. Yeah, Brian, you're bang on, mate. Yeah, I'm gonna have to because, like you said, it, it it'll flex again and it might snap me up. So yeah, I'm gonna have to. I will be doing. A, I will be putting a frame. I just I, I'll nip out later and to um, but and qua. All I'm gonna do is another door frame architrave that type of thing. That's I'm only gonna buy a strip of that. And then, you know, I mean, try and nail it in and, and try and botch it up a bit. So, <laughs> you know, I mean, and we won't film that bit, right? So, <laughs> um, but the, oh, there's Josh, he's come back. He's done a run of Josh. Uh, well, you'd be surprised, to be honest, because that is not, it's not a, uh, that's quite, oh, I feel a fit, I mean, feel it, well, look at it. Oh yeah, sorry. Right. It's not too heavy. It's not, you know what I mean. But I, I totally agree. Once the resin goes into it, it's gonna be, it's gonna be quite heavy. Um, so I am gonna have to frame it. Hence we, you know, I mean, uh, by doing this, I've been speaking to Dean, me and him back and forth, speaking to him and saying, you know, what I mean, uh, how can we support it? How can we get him to bed and stuff like that? What did he, uh, what did he use? Um, so Jason, actually, it's up there on, it's on the website, so you can put a link on to it. Where are we? Where are we going, mate? There, yeah. Oh, look at that, <laughs> a cracking shot. So that is our sand and gravel fixer. Okay, 100 mil, 100 mil, 100 mil bottle, okay, um, it's cracker. It just, you know I mean, it'll go off quite quickly. Yeah, um, there is, you can see the section by there. Oh, you can see a section by there that I've done maybe on camera three. Yeah, so where you can see now where that's dry, that all that's dry. Yeah, and I mean, and I've done some wet bits by there. Right, so it, it's you know I mean it, it it dries matte as well, uh, and it leaves a detail. It picks the detail back through as well. Okay, so great. Um, will you be doing any rocks coming out of the water? So once the I don't know yet. Um, I'm hoping that these might start stick out a bit, um, but I don't want to put a big massive rock in there. Almost eleven. Yeah, Dean's making it now. I know I can because he's not answering me. But yeah, so I can guarantee you that he's going to walk in there, get my cup, and make my make a brew. You know what I mean? But uh, Josh is pushing him now at the moment. He made it a cracking cup a couple of weeks ago. Yeah, and to be fair, Amy was working with uh, inferior materials. So, <laughs> <laughs> uh, so yeah. Uh, so uh, Kelly, I don't know yet. I, what kind of, I, there's another scene that I, I'm, I'm going to be using water all the time now because I love it. Like, you know, I mean, there's something I'm going into it. Um, well, I'm going to do a waterfall scene, uh, and that's going to be like a pool and plunge pool and all sorts of things. So, 
so I, in, in the next couple of weeks, you know, few, well, next couple of months, that'll be something I'm featuring. And guys, I am working on water, big style, right? Deep cast water. Uh, since a certain B word, it's been a nightmare. Uh, you know what I mean? So um, I've got samples coming. I've got to test them. I've got to do a long test on them because I don't want to go in yellow. I don't want to send something out to you guys that's, you know what I mean, that's inferior. So I am working on it, trust me, right? Okay. Um, we've got our water texture coming out anyway, which will give, I think, let me quickly read down here in a minute, any rocks. Impressed by the bird and the fish I saw earlier. Are they going to be through Wobble Gaming? Uh, no, Clive, they'll be coming through us as well, I think, as a diorama, on a diorama stuff as well. Um, we test in these. I just got Dean to test them to see if, uh, I mean, I don't know what we're going to launch. I think fish will launch, yeah, but the eagle, it all depends on where we can get on the bill plate. Um, I was wondering the same thing, Kelly, would it be ideal for ripples? And Yeah, so again, I, there will be ripples. And where, the, where the eagle's going into or coming out of the water with the fish, that's going to have a cracking bit of work. And again, using our water effects, which is over there, I haven't got it now. Uh, yeah, chuck us that, which is coming out very shortly, you know what I mean? Which I'll tell you in a bit, and then I'll remind you next week. Um, oh, we've got 21 people in, yes, but there's our water effects coming out, you know what I mean? That type of thing. Camera two. Camera two. Yeah, you know what I mean? Right, slosh it on, and you can make the, oh, sorry, our, our water textures. Yeah, you can uh, <laughs> make the water textures with that. Yeah, you know what I mean? Uh, don't put it on your face, it's not for quick face cream. <laughs> What makes gravel glue different from any other scene? Uh, nothing. You know what I mean? So it's, it's just glue. It's just sanding gravel glue. You know what I mean? It's something that we've we've come up with. and It disperses quicker. It disperses disperses quicker, yeah. It, uh, it, breaks, it breaks the surface tension, uh, which then disperses into the organic. You can add, you can add, you can do it with PVA if you want to, right? With water. No problem at all. Yeah, you know what I mean? It just takes five years to go off. Simple as. Ours takes a lot quicker. You know what I mean? And, it, and it's something that we make, so it's our brand. That's what I'm doing. Yeah, okay. Uh, it was one of the same thing. Almost level. I've read that one. I've read that one. Uh, that's what I was thinking, Brian. But yeah, yeah, I am. So I will be doing water effects, water uh, textures on you. So, you know what I mean? Uh, hopefully next week. It all depends on what we're doing. Can I find the glue on the website? Is it? It, on is, it is on the website. It is on the website. It is on the website. I've been told. Josh, can you find it? Jo well, I'll get Josh on it and he can do it. Thanks, thanks, Jason. Anyway, mate. Um, sand and gravel. Isn't it? Sand and gravel. Yeah, should be there, shouldn't it? I don't think I can send links. I do You'll have to join it. You're not a spanner, are you? No. We'll comment on it. And I'll make you a spanner. You're a spanner. I know, but. So it's under ballast glue. Oh, it's under ballast glues. Yeah, and then you choose the Modern with Amy. <laughs> yeah, they, Amy knows the products now. So, you know, he's, he's taking them and writing descriptions, to be fair to her. So, um, it, he's slow on his coffee. Come on, Dean. You know what I mean? Well, he'd it, be bang on your 11 o'clock. It's denying. Uh, <laughs> they, they're saying, uh, Carly's saying Modern with Amy because uh, he just commented on the, on the grant, Sam and Grab. <laughs> Amy is trying to model, to be fair, some, she has come some cracking ideas. Uh, the, um, if any of you have seen the, uh, the picture frame, uh, that, was done. that was done by Amy, lovely. And the MUDS, the MUDS video again, is, uh, you know what I mean, uh, created and filmed by Amy. <laughs> um, so, yeah, you know what I mean, so it's, uh, we, we are, they, they picking things up as they, as they go along. No, no more nails for water. Yeah, do you? Andy, are you, Andy, do you not work on a Wednesday? Search sand and gravel. Oh. Is it there? Have you put it up, Josh? I can't link it. Do you want to link it to you? Found it under ballast. Still, oh, he's done it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He's done it. Done. Thank, thanks, can you, make, uh, can you make me spanner? Thanks, Timber. You've just got a comment on it. Well, <laughs> Steve. Thanks, mate. Thanks for coming over. Yeah. Uh... Right, okay, so, um, blah, 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 that pick from, frame was standing, yeah, to be fair, it was really good, I was impressed, I couldn't do that, my, my fingers would be all over it, so, <laughs> like that, with big finger marks over it, so, it's quite hard to do, especially on a, it's quite a big, it must be quite hard to do, my fair dues, well done, you know, it's a big clap for Amy, you know what I mean, so. <laughs> 
Yeah, oh, look at that. That's that's what I love, Andy. Well done, mate. Excellent. Uh, have you announced the other person yet? Because I, you know, I mean, I, I keep rugby's on a Friday, unfortunately. So you know, I mean, you know, modelling is there. Rugby is is there. You know, I mean, there. <laughs> so you know, I mean, I was a coach and all sorts of things. Like, you know, what I mean, so um, I love my rugby. So unfortunately, I don't watch it. So. I don't know. I, I'm, I'm relying on Sam and, and, and Craig and they, they, well, enough said. So. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so I, I'm just going to add a little bit of things on the top while we wait. Well, I'm... So that glue on top of there, that there. So this is how fast that glue there is starting to go off on the rock. That's how quick it is. It's not labelled. Oh. I thought we had done a revamp on all these. We have. They just haven't uploaded. They just haven't mm. <laughs> Who is it then? Come on, let us know. <laughs> You've got, you know what I mean? Andy, come on. I don't know. Me and, you know what I mean? Obviously we've got... Me, Tim and Sam, I mean, there's the dream team himself, right? you know what I mean? It, 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 if they ever do a show again, you know what I mean? <laughs> we should all go on it, I reckon. I, you know, in the products, I know how to use the products. <laughs> you know what I mean? Supplied by people. Mm. Guion, oh no! How <laughs> did you... Guion, hey, oh great. <laughs> you just know all the gadgets is going to be on that one. That ain't fair. That, no, that's not fair. <laughs> Oh, great. <laughs> well, I might as well not bother turning up now. <laughs> uh, uh, no, not yet, man. T trees are, are getting, like, we're, we're struggling with getting them. We'll get them sorted. But C forms are in. Thanks, Jess. Uh, right. Okay, let me just uh, let's carry on, then, guys. Yeah, so I'm going back to um, gluing stuff now. On oh, I did this yesterday to something. The I kind of thought it's not working. I pressed it again and it exploded all over my face. Shocking, it was. Shocking as well. Shocking. So, drop some paint. Right. So, got my little depth stick. Yeah, so I've got a little mark on my depth stick. There. Yeah, so I know... Oh, that's not going to come up with the water. Damn it. Okay, I might do something different with that. Okay. What? So I've got a little depth <laughs> stick, so I'm going to... Where I want to put... Where it's going to come up. <laughs> And then I'm going to start gluing some foliage on there. Um, and I go in small, I'm not, I don't want a lot of. You, you know me, I don't like. Uh, I don't like to use a lot of clump foliage. Right. But on this one, I think it's worth it. I might use super glue as well. Yeah. I got some. So. Oh, here he is. He's oh, he's not lit either. Oh, see, I told you. He's made it dirty. It's a mask, Mister Glue mask. <laughs> Don't tell him. We got a little dipstick. <laughs> uh, so, um, put a super glue on to. Um, that might be, I might get out of the way there now. Move out of the way. You can see me. So, all I'm doing. Little plot, I got the pot, my usual pot that I use on the top. A little bit of super glue on the stem, and then I want to put it in at an angle because I want it overflowing the top, over sorry, overhanging the top. Oh, and I just blew the doors off. <laughs> Something like that. I'm not can't quite see it. You can see it like that. Maybe. Can you see that? What they done there? No. Wrong colour. White. No, that's better. 
Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Yeah, they are. Yeah, see that type of thing. So the water's going to come up to, you've got a water level that's coming up to there. Okay. Right. And then obviously I've got then that overhanging over the, over the top. And then a bit of yeah, controlled layering spray. Now I want to cover, I don't want to cover this. So I'm going to do this. And I'm going to put some of this foliage onto it. Oh, mate, I've missed you. Thank you, Dean. Dean's got the cup of coffee. There we go. Coffee time now. So that tree was amazing. Oh, just I saw you work on it. Brilliant. Sea foam trees are brilliant. Yeah, mate. You know, I mean, I seen that you was using the box yesterday, uh, but it came out lovely. Yeah, great. I'm gonna have to, I'll have to wash it through later on. Um, you know, I mean, um, yeah, right. You know, you know me. I am massive for sea foam. Yeah, sea foam is is, is an underused product in model rail for so in, in modeling, as far as I'm concerned, and it's very robust. Especially if you use it with. I'm gonna plug it now, and somebody's probably gonna say something. But use our layering spray over the top of it. It makes it far uh, far more robust. But <laughs> well done, good shot on that one. Yeah. Whatever you're doing, I take it. Suck it. I'm, like, I'm trying to lose weight. <laughs> and I have to watch my videos right at the back of when I first started the lockdown. Yeah, which was, um, you know, right, right at the lockdown. And I'm watching back now. I, 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 cause I am, I am trying to lose weight. I did 20k on the on the indoor trainer on Monday. I didn't go out for a walk yesterday, but I had a, I had a lovely Indian meal <laughs> and a and a and a box of wine. <laughs> you know what I mean? So uh, or a cup. Mate, if you anyway, so Jess, if you've done one a seam foam tree, you know what I mean. I know it's going to be outstanding. Full stop. Yeah, you know what I mean. Uh, I saw somebody on the Facebook group using the box again. Yeah, so um, you know what I mean. The box is doing well. Uh, and they've done the pl uh, revamped the plastic trees, yeah, with uh, with four mil, I think they added on. That, that was stunning, to be fair. That that, that looks stunning as well. You know what I mean? So, um, yeah, we it, make your own trees. You know what I mean? It, 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 you can see what I've done with uh, with the uh, Jess, I make. You know what I mean? Let me know. Did you do it with the? You know I mean? Straight from C form or what? Did it, did you glue glue it on like I was doing? Uh, which we got our video to go out, and we Amy. Uh, yeah. You know what I mean? So that's something else that we got to do. Right. What's coming out the eighteenth of March? That's all I'm saying. <laughs> uh, there's going to be a launch coming up soon. Uh, right. So my big announcement is on the twenty second of this month. Um, it's a Saturday at half past ten. I wrote it down on a piece of paper by it somewhere. Yeah, twenty second. There we are. Twenty second at half past ten. Uh, I'm having my second COVID job. <laughs> so Modern Room Martin ne uh, the, the week, that, that Wednesday, might be off because last time I literally, literally wiped me out. Yeah, and the, normally they say that the second one is, there's so many different things going on. The second one's worse than the other one, blah, 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 that type of thing. You know what I mean? So, Welsh gold is gold that, uh, that occurs naturally in two uh, distinct areas of Wales and highly prized because of its origin. It's, Oh, it could be a, yes, Welsh gold. Welsh gold is coal. <laughs> Welsh coal is the best. Anthracite, apparently. I don't know. We just fab. People from Wales are fab. We just so happy and stupid. <laughs> uh, no, we're not stupid. No, 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 I'm stupid and I'm Welsh. Anyway, so... Uh, are seafoam trees able to be sent to Australia? Oh, I can't remember. Simon, 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 Simon. Let me let me quickly text. Let me quickly find out for that one because that's a good one. Because there's some products we cannot send because of um, uh, what I call it because they are customs. They, they, to be fair, they're quite rigid. So let me let me find Simon here. Can see foam trees be sent to Australia? 
Jess, these are coming through now, mate. I'm gonna have a quick look. Sorry, I'm having a quick look. Jason just sent me through to it. Oh wow, dude. Yeah, that's wicked. That's stunning. Yeah. Show this camera. I've been. Oh, Amy, Amy, take over that. Because <laughs> that'll be useless. You might not be able to see it this yet. Oh, I'll let me come down and down. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Are you proud of that, dude? That's really stunning. Smart. I think we've got some more. Yeah, that is wicked. Nice one, mate. I'll have to watch that now. Excuse to watch it. Uh, my first... My first one was killed. Uh, my first one almost killed was... What? Well, that's not just the best of everything. <laughs> I care that you said that. Uh, you know what I mean? Not me, so... <laughs> Should I put this near the heater? <coughs> no, I'll leave it. Leave it. Work on it. I, I can work on it now. It's starting to go anyway. Okay. Uh, oh, Simon. Uh, so, from uh, my projects manager, uh, I asked, can seafoam trees be sent to Australia? No, customers have classed it as a hazard to the to their country so unfortunately seafoam trees you'll have to buy within Morica. COVID jab no way wow yeah well wow no mine was just I couldn't lift the, the TV remote I was like oh, I did lay on the bed for two days oh mate dude well luckily you know what I mean you stayed around dude you know what I mean and we're all the better for it so that's uh wow I didn't, you didn't tell me that. I didn't know that. Sorry, man. Like that. Right, so the other announcement I got is, um, uh, I might as well say it, because, you know what I mean, I'm going to announce it tomorrow, and announce it next week anyway. <laughs> it's because of the, of the seeds. Yeah, you know what I mean, they don't want a, a, it's the same as our forest ground cover. They class that as a natural, uh, a natural product, and they don't want it in there, what I call it, so... You can understand, I suppose. It's not good for their ecosystem. I keep always looking at the TV, but I should be looking at the camera. Now I'm looking at you, aren't I? So, um, so yeah, so I'm going to... Right, hang on. Uh, right, the the seat. So going back to our announcements again. So a cup of coffee, like I are saying. We haven't eleven seats yet, so I hope we've all got a cup of coffee. Um, 19th of May, which is... And I got, we're going to have to do it now, so if everybody's listening to your Chivers Hot Sweats blind oh, Jesus well I didn't get that I had shivers hot sweats uh, and just fatigued totally fatigued so I, I, I'm trying to make an announcement now and it was making about you Andy so <laughs> sorry mate I'm no, not I uh, mate you know we, well, we're, oh, we got a second one I'll tell you what the second one does I'm hoping that the second one is just I'm done you know what I mean that's it so I mean I had that and then lit uh, Two weeks later, I, two weeks before, I had um, tendonitis in my foot because of the way I was sitting sitting for three hours and doing live, um, and I couldn't walk the next day. Um, then two weeks after that, I had my COVID jab and struggled struggled with that. And then two weeks after that, then I had my wisdom tooth out, and that, that something happened there as well. Bird vision. Oh, not bad. Anyway. Okay, have you two finished an A and E now? So <laughs> can I carry on about me? <laughs> I'm joking. Uh, Dean Grumley work. <laughs> uh, yeah. So uh, the nineteenth of May, which is next Wednesday, uh, you are all pleased to know that our muds and water texture will be released. Yay! I can hear you. I haven't used much on you yet. Yay! Anyway, back to that. <laughs> yeah, we are. We we done. We sorted. We we sort of finalised it today. Uh, it is ready to go. They are looking awesome. Uh, I can't wait. You know what I mean? Uh, and I can't wait for the feedback. Uh, 
Uh, yeah, and so there we go. So the, I now say quietly because obviously you guys are distracted. So next week now I'll make a singer dance of it. Stuff like that. Uh, yeah, Simon, it will sort of. It will. It's already perfect. Uh, it's ready. They're all ready to go. So uh, get on with the work. <laughs> um, so there we are. I've announced it now. It's got to happen. So stuff. <laughs> Steve, thanks, Steve. Brilliant. Yeah, you know what I mean. My sympt going back to COVID quickly. My symptoms happened the week, the the day after. Yeah, so the two. So I had on a Saturday. Sat, I had on a Saturday about uh, twenty eight hours later. I was phew, washed my car in the morning. Fine, lovely, great. Uh, went in because I had a bit of an headache, and then went downhill, and I I was wiped out for a week. Oh, sorry, for to the Friday. The Friday was fine. Boom, job done. Uh, just added a photo on Seafoam uh, Cherry Blossom Tree on WW's Facebook page. Excellent. Thank you, mate. We'll have a look at that in a minute. Oh, my God. About time, Martin. I've not been waiting long. <laughs> I'm glad you're saying that. I am glad. I mean, the the, the, the famous word in here is coming soon. <laughs> Amy keeps is sick and tired of putting posts on saying, coming soon. So we, we'll get there. We'll get there. There's... You know, I mean, there's lots of reasons behind it. Um, you know, what I mean, uh, uh, but uh, we'll get there. You know, what I mean, red tape is I hate red tape. So there we go. But um, uh, yeah, but or, you know, what I mean, best things comes to those that wait. There we are. There's a nice little uh, a little thing onto it. Right. Okay. So I'm halfway through my coffee. Um, guys, hope you're enjoying it. Uh, Ray, I'll have a look at that later on and give her a comment on it. Right. You know, what I mean, it's bound to be. Uh, uh, a cracker uh, don't forget oh hang on don't forget as well um, I set up uh, we've got the 10 pound coupon ready to go um, we set up uh, the uh, WWS model of the month uh, the boys uh, have got a date of when they need to pick it yeah you know what I mean so Sam and uh, and um, Sam and Craig are picking it right so it's totally independent of us as well so which is great yeah, you know, what I mean, two fabulous modelers. We, we 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 all know that, right? And two great people, as far as I'm concerned, right? You know, what I mean, and I can't wait. That's another T-shirt. <laughs> Do you see that, guys? Kelly, there's another T-shirt. W hashtag WWS coming soon. <laughs> Class. Nice one. Looking forward to getting the mud's got a, a scene for them to use. Brilliant. Yeah, there is going to be a little instruction in there, but I I'm going to use them over the next. I'll use them on you now, I think, as well. You know what I mean? So um, uh, i got to do... I want to finish off a little bit through things. I might do a little... No, I'd, the problem with this is wet down here, really wet down here, and dry up there. So uh, maybe on the waterfall I can do a mud area. Or I'll do a... We'll do um, I don't know, a pig style or something like that. That'd be good, wouldn't it? You know what I mean? So um, I, the, the guys tend to um, tell me uh, what it is. I can't remember what I was talking about now. What was I talking about? No, the, 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 them, them two are busy working doing something else. Uh, oh, yes, mod, mod, Modeler's Month, month, month I can't even speak. Uh, Modeler's Month. Model of the Month, yes, that's what we were talking about. Uh, so, yeah, so put your photos on, guys, yeah, you know what I mean? Uh, it's, you, you, you get a chance then of going on, whether it's a good thing or not, but you get a chance then of uh, uh, um, your... Uh, your work being showed off on the Facebook group um, and our newsletter it goes on to I just want to say that it goes on to our newsletter now as well I was talking to Reese yesterday he does our newsletters for us so you'll have a little not, uh, a message on there like, and we've got thousands of people on there so you know, I mean, your work will get showed off on that and you get a £10 gift voucher off us as well right? you know, or it's a gift code um, so if you do win you've got to PM me right? you know what I mean? so just a, just a little bit of fun it's, only, it's £10 you know what I mean you can buy a bag of grass with it uh, you know what I mean, but it gets to showcase you you guys on the on the group as well, um, and obviously then maybe uh, I I have to speak to the boys, but we gotta uh, think about another competition. Um, we're always gonna do diorama because uh, we're not I'm, we're not a train company. Yeah, if I was a train company, if I was Hornby or Bachman or, or or something else, then I'd say do a train di diorama. But we're not we're a diorama company. Uh, and there's a lot of diorama modelers on there, like, and I mean, and I think you guys really loved it last time, as well, like, and I mean, because it uh, it got it got you out of things and, and to hopefully helped you to do to, to for modeling as well, because boom, it was crazy, that was crazy. Uh, talking about me, that's laughed. 
<laughs> yeah. So, um, so yeah. So get a chance. Yeah, get a, get your photos on there because I I love looking at uh, all the scenery side of it, all the hard work that you put into it. Uh, there's some fantastic mo uh, 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 shots on there already. Oh, never knew there was a, a prize for the monthly. Yeah, yeah, I didn't you? I, I did announce it. Sorry, Tim, but uh, I need to do a little. We need to do a little film then for Facebook group. Uh, you know what I mean? So I think Sam did mention it, but don't worry, we'll we'll do another one and I'll I'll make it. Yeah, it's only a little prize. It's nothing nothing big. You know what I mean? Uh, Ten pound gift uh, gift coupon or gift code. You know what I mean? Um, and it's free delivery over twenty five pounds. So <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh, if you want an applicator, you know what I mean, get some really good photos on there. Yeah, um, and we can all comment then and stuff like that, you know what I mean, because the group is fantastic. It's growing, 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 uh, you know what I mean, and uh, there's some awesome people on there, you know, and some fantastic modelers. So let's give something back to you guys for, for all the effort that you do to put onto it. Right, so uh, there's the announcements for this week. I'm still drinking. I still got three quarts of cup. So Amy's right by the side of me. I'm ready to go. Sod <laughs> off and to drink it. I'm on a sky. You know what I mean? So hmm. I'll have to continue drinking it as we go through. Right. Okay. So just we're gonna put foliage on there now. A lot more foliage. Like I said, I got my depth stick. Yeah. Um, just to make sure that I'm not. Uh, I, I don't want to go into the water too much. Uh, I don't mind going into the water, but I don't want to do it too much. So we're gonna do a different, different color maybe now. And again, a tiny, tiny little bit. Yeah, you know what I mean? Um, and I have, it does grow. I have seen stuff growing out of the rocks like this. Okay, so before anybody says, mm, no, no, phone grow like that, it does. I've seen it. My reference is, I can't see it. I think, I don't wanna to do too much of a, Contrast. Okay, so I'm gonna do something like that. There's my depth stick. Yeah, that's just just a neat under it. I'm gonna use super glue, guys, but you can use any white glue if you want to, right? Again, reason I'm using super glue because I want it nice, go off nice and quick. Um, spray the base on that because then it'll go. Oof. Okay, if any bit of foliage falls off. Don't worry about it, leave it there, okay? Right, and then, um, and this time, I'm just gonna put a bit of structure around it, maybe. Something like that. What do you think? Hmm. I'm gonna, mm. Yeah, looks good. Yeah, and that could possibly go into the water. So then, if it goes into the water, then you'd have a ripple effect. Okay, that's nice. What I'm gonna do with that? A little bit of layer spray on that. That'll glue it. Okay, and then maybe let's do that's too big. Bear with me two seconds and off cam. I'll do a little different colour maybe. What about the root that you had? Do you want me to put the root in? Rootness, rootness. Being instructed on it. <laughs> okay, so uh, there's a little, where are we? That one? Yeah. So there's a little root. Oh, come back. You might obviously see it. There we are. See that? Yeah, that little root. We just, Amy's asked me to put that little detail in and maybe grow it into the water. That That's simple. That's just a. It could be joined to this going through. I'm sure not. Tweezers on. Something like that. Yeah. 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 What's wrong with there? Some millipat. Last week's millipat. There we are. So I've just got an idea. So I've been using green stuff. Okay, but again, that one. 
Mm-hmm. They were, yeah. I think oh, everybody knows. Yeah, they were. I think everybody knows what that is. Yeah, Millie Pot. Okay. Yeah, we do sell this. Uh, hang on, can I love the comp. Not joined one before. Um, had the fun doing it and even everything that went wrong with it. I forgot off there. It was amazing. Yeah, to be fair. Uh, previous comment applies. Listen to the boss. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna make some. Uh, roots out of milli pot. I've done it before out of uh, green stuff, but I just want to show you that you can. There's no, you know, I'm gonna just use green stuff. You can use any any else. Uh, same. Th- th- those who have never used milli pot before, it's exactly the same. It's a two part red, a uh, two part putty. Okay. I do need a sort of cleanish area, just to roll. There are my my lovely assistant is helping me. <laughs> Far better than Josh. <laughs> oh, he's over there. He's good. You can hear him poked in. <laughs> yeah, so um, we literally need a slither, right? We don't need a lot, right? So I'm going to pinch a bit of that, but equal equal share, right? A little bit more. Okay, and then just mix them in together. Okay, see them back in the bag again. Uh, again, I'm just showing you how to use different types of products. You know, I mean, uh, the green stuff. If you've got the key tonight, if you've got that, exactly the same. Does exactly the same thing. So does this. Yeah, um, and you've got time to work with it. I'm just gonna get it in back in the bag box, by the way, and then just mix it up, and then we'll uh, create some more vines, vines, and roots. Okay, so just mix it up into, you know, we make sure the grey has gone into the, what do I call it, into the yellow. We'll have to paint this, but that, I, you know, I mean, we're a green or, or a brownie green, that's all we need to do. Yeah, with the, with the other colour, the, the other stuff, it goes, the green stuff goes green. So, um. Is it a bit slower? My cat, my cat attacked me last night. <laughs> I don't know why. Might have something now. Pulling his tail. So. <laughs> oh, morning. Um, morning all. Morning, Rich. <laughs> I didn't forget your name, it honest. <laughs> oh yeah, I did. <laughs> it went blank then, dude. Sorry. <laughs> Congratulations, young man! Are you enjoying it? Not long soon as well. Before we come, before we have another little one, we'll be all looking forward to that. I think. Okay, so that's mixed up now. I think it's quite soft now as well. So uh, just little, little bit off, yeah, and then roll it, roll it into a sort of vine stroke thing shape. Yeah, and then what we can do, uh, tweezers. It's quite sticky, right? So tweezers, um, stick it into the area, close to the area that you want. <clears throat> See what I'm saying? That's how sticky it is. Actually, that's falling quite natural. Oh, it down here. It's a bit like a snake. Mm. Get off. You can see I really, really love using these. And it snapped. So. Uh, I got Millie Pot in my hands. So a bit of just wet it up a bit and it doesn't stick then. Um, it just snapped to me as well, so. So the green stuff will work in exactly the same exactly way? Exactly the same way this is. Yeah, it's just different product, that's all. 
Okay, so there's a little bit of detail gone into that, yeah, which the roots will go into the water. So same thing again, yeah, just roll it into a point, okay, and we can just shape it then, like, I need to press that down onto the rock. Somehow. <sighs> So same again, I'm wetting the, uh, I can do it, it's a pain in the butt to use, I need a smaller, cool, I'm all about clean. It's a lovely camera angle. Oh. Cool. No. Need to hide that, so I'm going to do a little bit of. Uh, I need to put a this tiny bit of that just there. Okay, put it where's my other pot gone? Put a super glue and in there just to hide that under there. There we go. Yeah, mm. no, yeah, looks good. Okay. Something simple like that. Just adds the detail to it. I mean, you can do the naturally, do it naturally if you want with a sea foam, which we've done there, or you can, you know, I mean, use the milli putt like we have, yeah, and roll it up, okay, and it's just that starts to add detail, detail, detail. That's all. That's what we're trying to do but there. I think that's going to be too high, but then it would stick out. Oh, the other thing that we can do now. Again, we're going to have to be painted, right? And you have to be careful of scale. But look at that. That detail on that. It's too big. Uh, well, I'm going with it. So I got. So these are the twigs that I had. Yeah, when I was doing it, I can't, I can't get the camera. Yeah. And the detail on it, stunning. So again. Yeah, you can have it so it's sort of trapped. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Uh, he, uh, what's then told me? What was it? Kelly. So I'm going to, this rock by here now, I'm going to glue down by here. Kel, I'm going to show you something now that you can do. Um, I'm Bry, right? So I'll put a super glue into there, right? I'm going to put that. <laughs> I don't know where I put the super glue. <laughs> so I'm gonna re-add the super glue for that, and then put that into there. <laughs> I can't believe I can remember that. Then, right. So all of a sudden, we still got sort of like uh, <clears throat> it flowing that way. But also now, I'm gonna do something like that. Yeah, or possibly. Like that. Oh, that's better, isn't it? Yeah. Right. So now, right, you can see that sticking out. Uh, and there, there's my water level. Okay. And it's just. So it'll just be the tip. So it's just sticking out. But then you have the the, the froth going over to that. So I need to make sure that that one there is glued down. Okay. And I'm looking at the spot that I'm gluing. I'm not taking my eyes off the spot that I'm gluing. I just took my eyes off it, but I can see it. Stick that into there. And now we're going to stick. So we're going to put a glue onto there. Super glue onto there. Okay. And a bit down by here. And over it goes. Look at that for detail. Yeah, you can see if I put, uh, where's that big brush gone? Like a chicken there, yeah. right? See the big brush? Why two in, inch and a half? No, no, no. No. That's gone. Oh, look at that. Yeah, look. That's alright. Right, there we are. You can see it there. If I do that. Mm. Yeah, look at that. I got so giggly then. <laughs> I'm a giggly person. 
Right, so we're going to do a little bit of this all the way around. I mean, there, obviously the water I did was having it this way, but I've changed my mind and got another water coming this way. Right, so obviously there's a natural thing by there. So we'd have a lot of debris by there. Especially when I put that rock by there. Okay, so there's little bits of pieces that, that we can do. We don't want it too big. But we can have that. And then you can have like lots of little twigs. There's a nice one. You know what I mean? Piling up like that. Yeah, that looks good. Yeah, that type of thing. Okay, so that's dry fit in it. We know what we want to look at. And then we super glue that into there. And we want it just on the corner of there, so because that rock will be caught. Perfect. Is that and that right? And then we'd have it stuck on here. Like so. And then a bit of another debris, and I'm gonna stick this in it like that. Stick in like that. I need some small so uh, I'm going to use that's what I want. so I'm going to use these thinner pieces by here so I'm going to strip myself a minute like so and then well this is quite fresh so I can't <laughs> just drop the piece that I wanted thank you Amy yeah yeah so just we want the debris but I want to stick it out the water but I don't want to overdo it either oh well, that's a good spot so I'm going to just glue that maybe there if I can I need to push that down well, what I'm going to do over there now quickly before that goes off it's a little bit of algae I got a smile from Amy on that one, so that's good. that must have worked the treat. A little bit later, this way, yeah. Right, because I want gently now. Not Which way much. is the water going to flow? So I'm flowing it down from you down to the TV. Okay. Yeah. So it's going to go that way. Yeah. So I'll push up against these. So I'll push up. So it's coming in there. Yeah, and the push up that's why I'm putting that that, mm. that way then I was having it that way but for some wrong strange reason I had the fish eagle going that way so uh. it meant that the fish is going to go that way so it's going towards that way so we come in that way I'll show you uh, you could make it look like a uh, real river by putting it upside down shopping trolley <laughs> yeah believe it or not that's canal set We are, I'm thinking of doing something like a canal set that'd be wicked uh, yeah, so it's just, you know, I mean, there's just bits of debris then that will be, you know, we can just put in and stuff like that. But I'm just trying to dress the uh, the bank area right now. Let's look at my coffee. So there's a little ridge there that I can grab something growing, but I need to have a look. Uh, so my, my death stick. Yeah, that's perfect. So there's a ridge and when Amy shows me again, there's a ridge just, just for there, okay, which again is close to the thing, and I want a nice long. Oh, wow, that's lovely. Little subtle. Okay, I need a bit of super glue on that. Tweezers, because I don't want super glue all over me. Not like Kelly. <laughs> just there okay now and I always add I love this again I love this the delicacy of the sea foam so we're gonna add just a little bit maybe like that Yeah, 
Yeah. Yeah, Aiden needs my approval. I might I can't see it. Can't see it on that one quite well. So mm. can you see it now? Yeah, I can see it moving. I'll, I'll glue it in now and then uh, we'll get some good shots of it. Again there'll be camera shots I mean photography shots later. There we are, I've gone close in there. Ah, that Excellent. Come on, it's a little bit of super glue on it and stick it in. And then that's it fall leave it fall. Glue it in. Look at that on there, it's stunning. Yeah. And glue it on there then, is it? So a little laden spray. Again, the more layer spray you add to the add to the sea foam, the thicker, the stronger it gets. Okay, and and don't worry about the the see the layer spray going onto the model, right? It's it's fine. It's fine. It it it'll it'll cope with it. Um, it dries matte anyway, so and I want a little bit. I'm gonna keep my lid off, right? Just just a little bit better. And again. And I keep saying it, it's fallen into there, but it doesn't matter because that would naturally happen anyway, because it'll sink to the bottom as well, you know what I mean? Because the foliage and stuff like that, and, and it coming off that. Okay, so I finished my coffee, that can go away. All right, you can see now, I'm starting to enjoy myself now, yeah? You know what I mean? I can want to cut it. Um, I just... Uh, that would make it Australian. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, but Brian, no, you've just got to see some of the canals around our places, man. You know what I mean? They'll have, there's all sorts of things. I think there's arms and legs hanging out of it as well. So, you know what I mean? So, Ray, I 3D printed a trolley and bike, uh, a washing machine, and some other rubbish from the canal. <laughs> I could care, like, yeah, bang on. <laughs> Where are you from in Wales, Cal? You know, I mean, you've got to be from, you know, I mean, local area, I mean, me. <laughs> uh, Kelly, I think, um, thinking of putting a man on a, on a, on the bridge. Ah, uh, yeah. You see, I've done him throwing in magnetic things yeah. in, not you? <laughs> okay. So, I've seen something that I want to get rid of. Little pools by there, look. And that, just by there. Get rid of that. Sorry, man, it's just in your shot. No, it was good. Okay, um, I want to grab some more. So, this is looks so dead and looks so real, doesn't it? But it's from my pear tree, which my builder, those of you know that I'm building an outdoor kitchen. <laughs> my builder, we're working, my miss is not happy. He I snapped. think you should keep one quite long. Long, long? Mm. You've got to watch scale, right? looks good can't see I it <laughs> can't see it but I don't know if it's going to be the depth of water oh it's too deep oh. darn it what if you put it on some rocks so like that will it make it higher it will but he won't have it balancing like that just so we think of sticking this out to the water but it wouldn't look. It doesn't look right if it's on a brick. What if you built the sand Could higher? Do something like that, and then or or have it. Like that, and then have it as if that is a fallen tree, uh, and then we put that around there. What if you had some other branches coming off it? So the tree's still growing, maybe. It's just fallen. I don't want to get dead. Yeah, it can still be dead, but just have a couple of other... Some other like this. Just a little bit. Like that? Yeah. That? Yeah, just like that. Maybe not as bushy. Yeah, peel it off a bit, make it look more dead. Like that? 
Yeah, that looks good. Yeah, that's over the water on it. Mm. Okay, so we'll, we'll right there. Yeah, I so think so. So we glue that into there, yeah? Let me look at the depth. That might not go that deep. I might need to come up a bit. No, that's all right. Okay, so I'll glue that into there. Right now. So the decision's made. <laughs> I mean, a lot of a lot of modelers like guys would have all this done. And for poor t poor toilet, no way! Oh my god, you really know screwing. You know what I mean? Living in Wigan, sorry. So you know what I mean? <laughs> Nine years. Well, see if you put toilet, it's about far better. So anybody who knows what poor toilet, poor Talbot. Uh, there's two famous, two really, fa three famous people that come from there. But the first one is Sir Anthony Hopkins. Yeah, he's from Port, to uh, Port, Port Toilet, Port Talbot. Um, oh, who's the other one now? Sheen. Michael Sheen, is it Michael Sheen? Oh, Michael Sheen, yeah. Yeah, Michael Sheen, he's from Port Talbot. And Paul Potts. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> I'm not from Port, to Port Talbot, I'm from Morrison. What's famous come out of Morrison? Morrison is quite famous. So Wales' biggest hospital, Morrison Hospital, that's in in Morrison. The uh, the DVLA, yeah. So all of you driver's license people are DVLA. I live on the road of DVLA, yeah. So on the, the old DVLA, okay. Uh, so that's in Morrison. Anything else? I don't think there's anything else. There's no famous yeah. people. There probably it. is, but uh, so uh, yeah. yeah. Moriarty brothers, they are the all rugby boys and, and Lions boys. They they uh, they from Morriston. Uh, yeah, there's a lot. There's a lot, there's loads of rugby players. <laughs> you know, it's probably all rugby, and it's probably a famous Morriston somebody anyway. But there we go. So yeah, so Port Talbot, uh, we got is the the famous is um, Hannibal Lecter himself. <laughs> so yes, so that's where Kelly's from. Oh, well, Kelly, I picked up for you. Look, yeah, so you got to pick me up back. Right, let's get on with this. Uh, with that branch, so we want that branch. So before I put that branch on there, then we're going to need some sort of foliage around it. So something like that, possibly. Yeah. Yeah. The darker one as well. Then maybe on the other side, going in. Maybe some of this small stuff then sticking out. I don't know if I like that. I don't like that. Let me give me two years. That there is too big. And that is too big. Put that like so. So, a little bit of modern going on. I got, I can't find my uh, scalpel. This scalpel's gone. It's murdered, and no one, I told no one to touch anything on my desk, and I guarantee you in Dean's room, there's loads of stuff in there. Actually, this is better because this is my modern tool. So we'll cut it about there. And we'll have it. Coming off the tree. Then we'll drop it. And we'll roll it. Stick to me. <laughs> Come on, you son. Jesus. Oh, you son of a cut it. 
squad. This is key tonight. It's pretty. It's a little bit better than this. It's not so sticky. I just squished it on the. system come out the bottom if we can Brian said to put a snake I have got snakes but it's a bit, bit scaly be a bit big we've got spiders we've got snakes we've got to be fair to Dave you can you sculpt them all in 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 and they are resin so they hand sculpted destroying it now come on okay that's one No! Okay, I am going to do it. I am not going to fail on this one. I am going to do it. I need some better one than that because I picked up some junk. I'll glue it. That's what I'll do. How are we doing? What are we looking at? A poor Talbot actor is Richard Burton. Uh, Richard Burton, yeah, he was more the Ronda. Was he run there? No, 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 Meath Valleys. So yeah, yeah, what I call it. Um, Anthony Hopkins, Michael Sheen, Ronald Lewis, never heard of him. Rob Brydon, Rob Brydon, Rob Brydon, I thought, good God. I didn't know that. Yeah. A mecca of our talents, one one part of the tree out of the water, we'd, we'd have a snake's son of itself, uh, yeah. We could have the eagle taking the snake. Oh! Mm -hmm. I don't need a bird. I have asked Dean to make, to make me a crocodile. You could make a snake out of this stuff. Yeah, I, no, no, shut up. I'm <laughs> not that good. <laughs> right, get it in place. Oh, and everything's going all wrong here. Stress me out now. That's all I got. I'll use two tools. It's probably a much easier way of doing this, and somebody's probably right now watching the telly screaming at me. Do it this way, do it that way. However, I'm not. Right. Okay. Sack hat. <laughs> Done my head in. I'm not doing it. I'm doing it out of seat. Out of. Oh, have we got any green stuff? Uh, we should do some work. Have we got any green stuff? I'll use green stuff. Because I hate it. I hate this stuff. I want to drop everything here. Alright. Don't worry about it. Right. I get annoyed now. So. Unless you just use more boots. We haven't got any root. It's quite hard to find the roots on that thing. Uh, right by the actor, a comedian that's brought, brought up in Bagland. Ah, right, okay. You're Googling this now, right, innit? <laughs> Kelly. Kelly or Kelly? What about this? Only one thing. Too big. No. Too big. Uh, only one thing I know about your town. <laughs> Sir John Morris, yeah. Sir John Morris is the responsible. Is is Morris 
is Morriston, Sir John Morris, yeah. Uh, responsible for the construction between uh, 1976 and 1974, Morris Castle, yeah, yeah. And uh, that's the only because I did think about in school. Yeah, but John Morris is, uh, he, John Morris um, pretty much built Morriston. Oh, I know the tabernacle, 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 I can't say it. The, the church thing in um, in Morriston, I think it's the tallest or the biggest tabernacle, I can't say it, that thing in, in, in the world, apparently. There we go. Yeah, uh, I used to live in a, a place called uh, Cumgos, which... Um, there's some famous people like Shane Williams. Everybody knows Shane Williams. Gareth Edwards. Everybody knows Gareth Edwards. Yeah, you know, I mean, there's the two, probably the two best Welsh players has ever had. Uh, uh, Rob Brydon is like Rob Brydon is is known for Bryn, isn't it? Yeah, two words. Sat nav. <laughs> I love Bryn. He was brilliant. Fair to Rob Brydon makes you laugh really, really, really funny. Haven't used your sea phone routes yet. Uh, might look as good as. Yeah, Amy just turned around and said about that. So I'm gonna look. Might be. I got one little one down here. Oh, hang on, I got a couple. Bear, Amy. Okay. So I'll take a few off there. But uh, that's a good strong root. I'll take that one off of there. That's a good curly one. That is. It's quite nice. And then I might just stick these out. And we might be able to use things like that. Okay. So yeah, there we are. We just had a Morriston versus. Poor Talbot and poor Talbot one hands down. So <laughs> big style. <laughs> so I got little strands of sea foam by here, tiny little strands of sea foam, right? Which I'm just gonna cut off the top. Which I can use as roots. And then I got a good nice bit of root by here that I'm gonna stick in. And I'm gonna stick it in straight away. Uh what was that? Uh, Divi, what's Divi, mate? What's your name? So I, I don't have to call you by Bagland. Bagland, yeah, yeah, that's another. I worked Port Talbot and Bagland. Back in the days when I used to work. <laughs> oh, actually, that's stunning. Oh, that is wicked. You're missing it. What? Oh, she's running, she's running over. <laughs> that didn't look like a root so much, but look at that. Oh, nice. So using sea foam roots as roots, much better. Got a lovely shape in it, that's why I want to use it. Oh, if you stick by there, that'll be wicked. Did it stick? Oh no, give it a little bit of squiggly quick. Teeny bit. Sticky thing quick. that job done okay and now we'll hide that little bit with a little bit of foliage We don't need to like that, do we? No, I think it looks good. Okay, and then there's that tree that was sticking out. We want it foliage up. So that way or that way? Foliage down, really, don't we? Because it's yeah. going down, isn't it? And then we'll have it sticking out somewhere there or there. There. There, is it? That looks more natural, doesn't it? But I go. There's my depth tester. Yeah, we're way above the thing there. I'm gonna stick it. If I can, get a big dollar of glue on that. Get that. Stick it there.
<laughs> Wicked, look at that guys. Uh, this is just, we just build in detail, that's all we do. And what, what I can do now is... Uh, maybe, like, because this could be underwater, but you have debris sticking around there maybe. It's too big. I can leave that there because the thing will. And then something like that, maybe? Was that too much? No, I think it's alright. Yeah. Okay. Or maybe, I don't know. Oh, yeah, okay. Maybe too much. Just a little one. That there? Yeah. Because that's going to. That'll be underwater, but it'll be trapped under a brick, if you know what I mean? Under a stone? That will be underwater. Just. Okay, so we've got a nice feature over there in that alcove. The thing is, pouring water into that is going to be a nightmare. <laughs> well, do we want? Do you want any foliage on that? Mm, do we? No, because it's not here, isn't it? Okay, so no foliage on that one. Okay, cool. Maybe. Play with me. foliage on there okay cool right there we are we've got some good detail coming into this now yeah and i haven't even touched the top of that what time is it as well it's coming up to 12 o'clock okay so we've got a, for a half hour uh so I'm, I'm really enjoying playing with that but we need to have something nice and juicy now on the top so we want something like this now right something like that And tell me if you like it. And then use the C form there. Just to build up. It sort of breaks up that solid. What do you think? No. No, I don't like it. So if we get rid of that. And then use this. Use that. Is it just going to stay there? Yeah, well, we'll have to glue it down, and then I'll add the foliage to it. No, this looks like a bu bunch of weeds, doesn't it? Hmm. Need a year of that. So better off sticking up with this then, really. We it's this colour, it is. It's it sort of doesn't go with the thing that the rock where that does. I tell you what we tell you what we need to look now, and it's something juicy, it? something nice. Have a look. See what we can do here. I'm thinking of maybe or there, maybe. Oh, don't know. There. I need to. So I'm just, oh, that could be an area right there. Okay, so tree there. Yeah. So we're going to make the tree now, yeah? Okay, right, so here we go, guys, I'm making a tree now. Right, so uh, we got a stick, yeah, which is now the trunk, right? It's a lovely shape, right? And I want to make sure that I get the angle of the shape right as well. So we can see the shape the well, I think that's the way yeah okay so and then what we're gonna start building now is trunk is is foliage right okay so can I have uh, cut that one there because I love all of a sudden love the shape of this it looks stunning 
and then that would be the trunk and one there yeah yep okay boss has spoken yeah so this is me now we're gonna this is why making a tree out of a trunk out of a twig and i'm gonna need amy as well to to do some spray for me oh actually where's my clamps do my clamps are gone no i lost my clamps we change things around and i've got a new table and those of you that are eagle-eyed will know that i've gone lower however moving things is gone so i'll spray it yeah so what i'm gonna do is get amy to spray it so i want to spray it away from that lid because i think so Tell me when. and oh, no when missed should i do it again mm, go on right you did <laughs> it's harder than it looks it was my fingernails <laughs> it was freezing all right so there's one okay so just so branch selection is key as I told you before and when you come when you're looking at it looking for branches but this one you know I mean the last one I was doing is I struggled to get good branches but now I'm looking at it and can get I'm looking wow they, they, we can get some really good ones so snap some off there's a top oh that's a nice color yeah there's a top I can get it Oh, there's another branch. That's the branch that's on the tree. Oh, that's a good branch. It's the branch just took it off. That's why I need a clamp. Uh, I need to glue that back on. Okay, it's a good blob of blue on that one. And I'll try and get it on. Hang on. Go. Okay. Put that down, Martin. Now we'll look for a branch. Uh, that might be another good one. It's too, too branchy. I have something stuck to me. Yeah? Spray down now so you don't spray me. Go. Let's put one under there though. That's all right. You can fix that to what I call it. Do one hand. No, it's like, go on, I got it, I got it, I got it. We can't hold it, do we? Come back to Okay, so just, all we're doing is just branch selection. I'm just trying to do it as quickly as I can as well, so. Just trying to. So you got still talking about uh, Port Albert. Steelworks in Port Albert was what, at one point the biggest in uh, in the world. Good. 
just trying to, like I said, I'm trying to knock it up as quick as I can. So, I, and I mean, you guys are not just sitting there watching me do something. I think what I do is cap it now. Have a nice little. Yeah. yeah, it fits in there perfect. <laughs> right, that's it, isn't it, really? Yeah. We don't need much more on that, do we? No, I think it's good. Yeah, so there's a treat. Okay, I think Amy will get a better shot with it later on. Right, Try camera three, maybe. Camera three. It's quite hard, isn't it? Mm. See it. You'll see we'll have a good shot of it later on. And then we're gonna all we're gonna do now is super glue that in a way. Ah, there we go. Like that, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, we can see the bendy branch. So super glue that big dob of super glue with that. And I want to go. Oh, does it need something for that? I don't know, Ryan. I think it does. Yeah, it does. <laughs> <laughs> From this angle, it's lovely. It's lovely, and then we need just need a little thing for that. So I got a nice little one there. That will go lovely with it. So foliage up. There, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Good dollop of super glue on it. It's a little stick. That was me. <laughs> And there we go. There we are, we just knocked up a quick tree. Yeah, and that looks quite stunning. Look at that. Yeah, we got Amy trying to, we trying to get all sorts. We left off little white cards, that's what we left. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so it's starting, to, starting to add up now, guys. Yeah, it's starting to really look short, shape, take shape with it. So what we're going to do now is strengthen this. Amy move the keyboard and us out. Strengthen it up a bit, right? So a little bit of laser spray over it, and then we'll put some foliage over it. As we do, okay. Uh, this color. Yeah, I'm gonna take some off. Like the, the, there's some falling on the rock, which I don't want on there, so I'll just sweep it off in a minute. Now, so. Okay, I'm happy with that. I'm not gonna do much more than that. And then uh, just get my brush, sweep that off. I don't want it on there. I don't want it all on there, but some of it can stay on it. Actually, it looks quite smart. But what we need is maybe some foliage around it. Not a lot. Yeah. I got a smile from Amy, so that's it, it, the smile of approval. Put a super glue on that now. starting to come up quite smart right I'm gonna make, oh, I'll take that uh, thing off and keep that thing off. Put it on there. okay right uh, no nice chicken blah 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 we are fully entertained with your with your never mind the modeling <laughs> never mind the modeling Martin <laughs> uh, he is known as a chicken thief well, who's a chicken thief uh, okay, Jones was born Thomas John Woodward. <coughs> uh, 57 years old. Three Forest, Pontypris in Clermorgan, South Wales. Pontypris, crack in when we got John. I don't know who the, who's. Ah, uh, Tom Jones. Do, do, do. Yes, Tom Jones. Pontypris. Yeah, yes. I also know as a chicken thief. Uh, 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 Kelly has uh, BPR. Yeah, BP on one side. It, it did have. That was. Um, Oh no! What's a what's a friggin' uh, Thandarsi? BP Thandarsi it was. Yeah, B 
BP Long Darcy and the steelworks on the other front. Yeah, massive. The steelworks is huge, five miles long. It is massive. A beach, yeah, Aberavon Beach, stunning place. Aberavon Beach is, yeah, you know what I mean. Still haven't got the best ice cream there though. Yeah, Jaws is the best. We all know that, dummy guys. Dummy guys. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. uh, behind the mountain is a child. We were told if the if the BP alarm goes off, uh, we were to hide under the desk in school. <laughs> yeah. yeah, boom. Uh, my dad we used to work in the BP Sundance. Been many, 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 many years. It didn't help. Uh, that's not blue. Uh, it was white right around the town. It right out every three. It right out South Wales. Yeah. So anyway, um, if anybody's watching modelling, right? You know what I mean. So oh, we got thirteen people in. So thanks for stick, sticking with us, guys. Yeah. You know what I mean. Um, come up to me. What time is it? Yeah, we'll carry on a little bit more. I got. We got a little bit more. I need to make a point of interest for you. Okay, because that's uh, there's it's boring by that to be honest. Okay, so we need to do something with that. But don't forget the feature of it. Obviously, it's going to be oh, there's my book. It's going to be the eagle. Okay, which I've buried out and super glued myself. Oh, and I dropped him. Don't don't damage him. Dean will go nuts. Yeah, it's going to be the eagle. So it's going to be quite a you know. I mean, I'll have to make it sort of. There's a feature there now. That's a big, strong feature. Because I was going to have him on a branch. Like that. Coming off. Into, in. Well, that way. But I've told he's flying. So he's coming into the water. Um, that's just huge. Anyway, so I'm just going to carry on a little bit longer now. Um, we need to put something up, up at top. Some foliage. Something there. Yeah, that's nice, I like that. And there may be a nice big bush. I'm just going to look at this in a minute. Like that. Too big because it's out of scale. Maybe there. Can I, can I have a look? Can I have a tree that I can use? A sea foam tree? Just a tree as opposed to doing what I've done there? Jason's done. Mate, no, you're wrong. I'm sorry, mate. Bang it wrong, totally and utterly. Right. Joe's ice cream, as we all know, is the best. It is absolutely stunning. If you've never tasted Joe's ice cream, then you don't know. End of. <laughs> yeah, but. Cal, oh, oh, out, no, best ice cream, Jaws, full stop. No, I don't know about that, I need somebody's opinion, come here, Amy, what do you think, we have a tree like that? Too big. Yeah, I think so. I chop it down. I'll take that away. And that one. Chop it down. Is that better? Yeah. Yeah. Like that. Yeah. In 
time there. Oof. Okay, job done. Because this is adding height now to the to the. Uh, to the model as well because these are coming off the model if you know what I mean with the spray okay I just glued it into the foliage and not into the rock or onto the rock which is wobbly. Okay, that's better. You know what? I'm gonna need to get rid of you get rid of that. Okay, so starting to come that's me. <laughs> Let's friend uh, called Johnson from the Creed. <laughs> I think everybody's called Johnson Body Creed uh, the timber bit. <laughs> Jones Evans. Uh, uh, you know what I mean? They're the they the that's like the, the Smith of um Wales. The manners are cracking at the shop. I mean like uh, you can see that. I'll add some foliage to that now. Actually, do I do do we do a flower on that? What do you think? Yeah. Pink? Yeah. Just pink. But I need to make sure. It only goes on the tree. A big dollop of that. It's too big, I too think. Big as well. Cut it as well. Yeah. I think that's enough. Or do one more? No, I think that's good. Yeah. Now well, we've got a little bit of a pink flower going on there as well. <laughs> yeah. We all can sing like him as well. Best singers in the world. We out some twenty thousand Zulus. <laughs> right, I think. Chaps, twenty past work well, twenty past. Um, 12 coming up to dinner time these guys got to eat uh, I'm gonna add so I gotta add more more detail to it yeah I think it's gonna you know I mean start coming to coming together um, there's a couple of spots I think oof but again do I not I've got an interesting bit for there that's quite interesting because there's a lot of detail for there and a nice little bit of detail for there that's a bit boring at the moment and the top is boring. I don't know what to do with the top yet. I'll, I'll have a think, and I, we'll me and we'll do some tests. Yeah, you know what I mean. Um, but other than that, I got to box it up. Obviously, the feature is going to be, and I think we'll have to do it roughly around about there. Yeah, and that all of a sudden gives size to everything, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So if we do it roughly around about there, right? You know what I mean. Another splashing feature and stuff like that around it as well. And then we got points of interest then as well, okay. And I believe that the that now now that we've added the foliage and stuff to it, I think where you guys were, like, you guys I'm talking to you two, mm -hmm. I don't like the color of the or, or the or the base. It's quite, it's starting to come quite nice now. Yeah, it's really nice. Cool. Okay, so. Um, Are you gonna Stephen? glue one fish in before? You've finished? No, um, um, the fish I've got, they're, they're being printed off. They, oh. they, I ruined them. So, <laughs> I, yeah, I ruined them. I had to do them again. So, so they're no good. The fishies are no good. But I will be fishing. So next week, it's looking good, uh, coming on nicely. Yeah, so so next week, um, we'll glue the fish in. Um, and then it'll have to be, it might be a short one next week. Because we'll glue the fish in. Um, and then I'll do the water. But we'll hopefully get, I'll, I'm going to get, Dean's going to have to help me put this base on. Because I'm not 100% what I'm doing. Like, you know, I mean, I don't. Because I don't want. I don't want to go. I don't really don't want a leakage because it'll ruin the model. And I, 
put a bit of effort into that. I quite like it. Like, you know what I mean? So, um, but we'll do a poll next, hopefully next week, and then um, and then I can come back to it in the week after, and then we can finish off. We can do the fish eagle and stuff like that the week after and stuff like that. So we do maybe do a short one, or I'll do the poll on this one. Uh, you know what I mean? And then carry on, get on with another one. I don't know. It might be a small diorama that we can do with something. Um, or maybe some questions and answers for you guys, like you know, I mean, or if you want me now to show you how to use, how to do something, uh, maybe do another seafoam tree um, and use the applicators or something, maybe that, yeah. Uh, thanks, Brian. Good night. Uh, good night to all you guys as well, uh, with Brian as well. Um, oh, t Tim, sorry, mate, we go in. So, <laughs> so it's you since you've gone back. Don't press that button yet, Josh. <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> Uh, nice guy, nice one, guys. See you next week. Yeah, um, again, you know, we we keep them going as well. They've, uh, we're doing well with these guys. I think I, I'm loving it. You know, I mean, it's a good good couple of hours then as well. Uh, and this is starting to take shape. It's starting to look really smart. Um, we'll, I'll ask Amy to or Josh to take some quick photos to get them out on the Facebook group. I keep looking at the TV when I should be looking at the camera, uh -huh. and these two never tell me doing it. Things like that. Yeah. yeah, but I'm reading comments as we go on the gut. Um, remember that the big release. Coming next week. Uh, also, Modern with Martin. Yeah, keep posting you. There's no. It's not like a competition, right? You know what I mean. Just post whatever you're, you you got the hand. Just post it out, um, and see what how it goes. Uh, Cal, lovely timing today, mate. Yeah, for uh, the the fish next week. I'll show you what to do. Uh, how 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 we can stem them as well. Um, other than that, guys, stay safe. Um, you know what I mean. Uh, we now can go out and get drunk, which I still haven't done yet. <laughs> right, but again, thanks for the support. Um, I'm enjoying this one. It's really looking smart. I already wanted to do a water scene. I'm nervous doing the water scene, so but you can see I'm having fun because we always know when I'm having fun. I just carry on going. Uh, until next time, though. Right, stay safe. Thanks for the support. Yeah, like it, share it, tell everybody. Let's get this going. Uh, your channel is to have a realistic weeping willow. Oh, just in the edge of the riverbank. Jet. No, no. <laughs> I'm going to make that off camera. I'd, I'd love to do a weeping willow, mate. Yeah, you know, I mean, there's some guys on, on the group has done it really, really well. Um, that's going to have to be a twisted wire one. And it won't be scale for this. It'll be solid. Um, but I'm going to do some research on it because there might be a product out there that I can find that we can utilize. So. <laughs> Other than that, stay safe. I'm going to press the button now, so thanks for watching. All the best. Bye-bye.